we're talking about retargeting, okay? Yep. Custom audiences. I'm going to turn it over to you to walk us through just an explanation of what phase one is and then yep. a demonstration. And then once we're done with the demo, we can talk about what phase two is gonna look like. All right, what's up? everybody at Uphex Nation. I'm going to consider you guys a nation at this point. We're growing really fast, which is exciting for us. And with all this growth comes, you know, new things. And one of the things that we like to do is release new features. Now, I don't always do. Usually this is my partner, Bradley. Bradley Kipp, say hello, Bradley. Hey, hey, we're shaking. Uh, usually Bradley will just release a short Loom video, show people what's coming, what it is, how it works, that kind of thing. Um, but this is a big one. And we wanted to walk you through it. We also wanted to give you a framework of how we're going to be rolling this out because it's not a single rollout. It's actually a two-part rollout. So Bradley, I'm going to, um, we're talking about retargeting, okay? Yep. Custom audiences. I'm going to turn it over to you to walk us through just an explanation of what phase one is and then yep. a demonstration. And then once we're done with the demo, we can talk about what phase two is gonna look like. Yeah, definitely. So I'll go ahead and share my screen so that everyone can see what we're seeing here. Um, but essentially, yeah, like Sam says, uh, this is going to be a multi-part release. We wanted to get something out to you guys uh, sooner rather than later. Um, that's what we always try to do. Um, so the first part is uh, retargeting to existing custom audiences in your client's Facebook accounts. So anything that they have available. So maybe it's something, maybe it's a custom audience that you've set up for them. Uh, maybe it's a custom audience that they've done themselves. Uh, whatever it is, whatever they see uh, here when they go to the audience in Facebook, uh, that is now available uh, in high level for them to use when launching a campaign. So I'll just go ahead and show you what that will look like. Again, Everything we try to do is we try to make it as super simple as possible. And so here you'll now see a retargeting option. Um, again, most, most clients will not need retargeting. Um, they will just still be doing traditional lead generation, um, but we did want to provide that option. So by default, it'll be selected to none, but then if they um, click the drop down you will now see all of those existing custom audiences that are now available. And if we go back to Facebook, you can see those same exact um, uh, custom audiences along with the description. So we carried over the description for each one uh, as well. Okay, so let me just real quick deconstruct uh, where we're at in phase one. Um, if mm -hmm. you're an experienced agency and you know setting up custom audiences, you know how to do that in Ads Manager, then by having set those up for your clients in ads manager, once you connect Apex to that ad account, then boom, these will all auto populate your clients that have those custom uh, audiences set up will automatically see them. So that's number one. If you're newer and you don't know how to do that, I'm guessing that Jacob on one of his Wednesday calls will probably convert that into how to set up custom audiences. Should you decide to go down that route now, if you've followed me personally for any amount of time, you've ever heard me talk about retargeting custom audiences. I have a guide, in fact, in our Facebook group that talks about how retargeting is a myth. Now, what I mean to say by that is the bulk of your activity as a direct response marketer is already done by Facebook's algorithm. However, there are models and strategies that can take advantage of retargeting and so we wanted to be able to provide that uh, to you guys, okay? So if you're newer and you're like, oh, well, I don't know how anything about retargeting, don't worry about it, okay? Just let your knowledge of how to use these strategies come. The more you implement, the more you educate yourself, the more you come to like our, we have weekly meetings where we're going over these types of things. The more you understand them, then you can start testing them, but don't feel anxious that you don't have these, you know, as part of your current marketing strategy. Okay. So that is phase one. All right. Talk to us, Bradley, then about what phase two of custom audiences and retargeting looks like. Yeah. So phase two is going to be instead of just pulling existing custom audiences that you've created in ads manager, uh, we're going to give you guys the ability to create custom audiences in Upex. So that will be 
again, something that keeps you out of ads manager. So that's, that's our whole shtick is Upex keeps you out of ads manager. And so um, we're going to give you the agency, the ability to create custom audiences for your clients here directly in Upex. So you'll likely see a new button here that says audiences. And that's where you, we will walk you through creating that custom audience based on meta sources. So what do I mean by meta sources? Um, so going here, create a custom audience. We will be able to pull over um, creating custom audience based on people who have interacted with your lead form, uh, based on uh, people that have interacted with your client's Facebook page, and also people that have interacted with your client's Instagram account as well. So that'll all be uh, coming. And again, you won't need to do it through ads manager. It'll all be available in Upex. Yeah. So it's an exciting feature development and we're happy to release it. I think there's going to be a lot of really interesting things that come from this. Um, it's a bigger build out than we've done on other feature releases. That's why this one took a little bit longer. Um, and that's why we're also uh, delivering it in two parts. So um, more to come on retargeting. We'll do another video like this when we do phase two to walk you through it. But uh, if you've been asking for this feature and you know about retargeting, then you should be super excited because you can start using this right now today. It's available in your Upex accounts. And um, Bradley and, and the development team, kudos to you, my good men and lady. Uh, you know, we don't yeah. want to just take, you know, hey, hey this is a uh, equal opportunity environment. We've got a lot of really skilled people working over here at Upex. So thanks to e the Issa, Issa, Issa was the main driver on this one, actually. Yeah, she's fantastic. Uh, anyway, so you guys, we're excited about this. I know you're excited about this. So thanks for watching. And, uh, you know, we'll see you in the Upex group. See you later.